Hi everyone, Liam here and welcome to this match preview and prediction for the match between Yannick Sinner and Novak Djokovic in the semi-finals of Wimbledon. Let's get into it. Well, a rematch of last year, obviously not in the semi-finals last year, but in the quarter-finals. And you know what, I'm excited for this matchup, but I don't think it's going to be as tight as last year's match. Obviously, we all remember that Yannick Sinner went two sets to love up against Novak Djokovic. And unfortunately, or fortunately, you know, for Djokovic fans... Yannick didn't end up winning the match. Djokovic came back from two sets to love down to win it in five. You know, looking at how their Wimbledon was going so far that last year was pretty different. Obviously, Yannick had had an incredible run so far getting to the quarterfinals last year, having beaten the likes of Carlos Alcaraz along the way. This year is a bit of a different story. He hasn't. He's only played one player in the top 80 in the world, and that was 79th in the world. And in his last match, he played against Roman Safilin and won in four sets. Whilst, you know, you look at the likes of Carlos Alcaraz or Daniel Medvedev or Novak Djokovic, who they've played to get to the semi-finals, it's been a much higher level of quality of opponent. But you can't blame Yannick Sinner for... You, you only can play there and beat the players that are in front of you, and he did exactly that. Some players might have choked in that situation, and he hasn't. And if you look at Novak Djokovic, as I believe his first ever Grand Slam semi-final, he, he, he reached the semi-finals by playing against players who are even lower ranked than the players that uh, Yannick Sinner has reached... Uh, played against this year so I mean you can't really blame Yannick Sinner for playing against the players he had to play against um, coming into this one obviously we know they're head-to-head -head. it's 2-0 for Novak they played twice before their last meeting was last year here, here in Wimbledon I do think that Yannick Sinner can take a set off of Novak we've seen Hubert Hercax take a set off of him Andrew Rublev take a set off of him so I think Yannick definitely has that in his locker but is he going to go all the way and win the match I don't think so. Novak is just on a different level at the moment. He's been in completely great form. He just looks like he's in control of matches. Even when he's losing a set or losing a game, he's in control of it because his serving accuracy is amazing. He might not serve the biggest serves, but he just has incredible accuracy with it. He knows exactly where to place it to get the ball where he wants it to come back to him. And you know what? He's just on God mode at the moment. So I think Novak gets himself into the Wimbledon final. And you know what? Is only one win away from uh, tying Roger Federer's eight Wimbledon titles and getting his 24th Grand Slam title. I think he wins against Yannick Sinner. I think he gets it done in four sets. 